what's up you guys welcome back to the channel it is officially 2021 and i hope that each and every one of you had a good happy new year and um i just decided to turn on the camera because why not you know we're going into the new year still staying consistent still staying positive still staying optimistic and still working to become better versions of ourselves and i'm just gonna still work and to you know build my life and find my purpose and i'm gonna keep going um so yeah i'm just basically here in bed i have not done anything i slept in um and today i've just been really just been fasting surprisingly because i just really didn't see myself doing any of this like i don't know if you guys really um if you guys remember what i said in my last video i just wanted I, I really couldn't think too far ahead of what 2021 what i want out of it um or anything like that and even this morning when i woke up i was just like i don't know what i want to what i think about the new year ahead what what plans i have or whatever so what i did decide to do today was just to do a whole bunch of inner work and soul work and um, and that's all I've really been doing ever since I woke up. I really just took it easy. I've been fasting. I, I really haven't had, like, I didn't have breakfast. I haven't had anything. I've been, I drank coffee, obviously. And I'm just drinking water with lemon. Um, just, like, really kind of just, like, resetting. That's really all I want to do is just, just kind of, like, reset and condition my mind, my body, my soul, my spirit. And just, you know, really nurture me really take good care of me right now i've just been listening to um sermons and taking down notes right here so you know it's real I'm taking down notes and just really meditating trying to stay away from my phone trying not to get distracted i feel moody like low-key i really feel moody like being just here not eating anything and just just really but i'm trying to stay mindful of just taking it slow taking it easy being really kind to myself um and to others because i feel a little bit moody but this right now in this moment was very much needed i need this and i'm gonna take the next few days to just really meditate and really reflect on, on what and who i want to become in the next new year have it become a part of myself and you know you know just kind of like evolve and blossom and grow so yeah as we begin 2021 I better hurry up because my battery is running low just let's just take it easy let's just take it one step at a time so yeah just want to let you guys know 2021 is here and i will catch you guys um later um i may make this into a weekend vlog i don't know but we'll see so bye what's up guys welcome back to the channel so it's currently saturday well it's the next day because we talked yesterday um don't forget to hit that like share and subscribe button so you're always in the loop when i post up new videos hold on girl hold on hold on people Just hold on hold on just don't forget to wash your hands don't forget health is everything i'm just like trying to get situated wait um how are you guys doing today it's the second day of 2021 the second day and i must say we're we're doing pretty i'm doing pretty good i feel pretty good um this morning i went and i got my nails did um i also went and i got a lymphatic massage a lymphatic i don't know if they just say lymphatic massage or if they say lymphatic drainage massage so basically what it does is just a massage that you know uh, flushes out all the toxins in your body um helps with bloating but mainly it's just really just to um flush out any toxins you may have in your body that you just flush out um like peeing whatever and all that and this morning right i took a picture of myself because i know eventually um i don't know when because i haven't planned it i'm gonna be working out i'm gonna be like meal prepping just like really just taking control of 
my eating and just getting back on track physically so I took pictures right just to have like that before and after and I this is the first time I go get the, the lymphatic massage anyway this is like my second time but it was like my first time was back in I think September so obviously with the new year obviously we all want to start fresh you know clean slate um, and I remember from the first time, like, I just saw results instantly. Like, my body just, like, my waist, my stomach looked so good. And I felt good, you know? It's, it's also really good for your body, too. So, um, if you guys ever decide to look into that, I highly suggest that you do. Um, so, I went and I did that. And then I compared my, like, how I looked after the massage with the photos that I took this morning. I couldn't get over it. I was like, oh my God. Like, I don't even have that pudge any, that little like, this little um pouch that I had, like a, a, the lower part of my stomach is gone. It's gone, it's not there no more. And it's like, my stomach just feels so much like lighter. I woke up so bloated today, this morning. Like I suffer from bloating anyway, but that just like really made me feel so much better. And then also on my agenda was to go get a juice. And this is their deep, this is from Juice Hub. If you're in the Jersey area, go to Juice Hub. This is my first time here, so I'm trying their detox and energy drink. Ooh. The ginger and the black pepper. But overall, really good. It's got a kick. I think it has turmeric in it too. I think. So it's got, it's got a kick. It's got a kick. Let me take out this other juice. Because I got one also for my mom. So, but other than that, that's it, you guys. And you know, another thing, I'm in this neighborhood, right? It's a really cool neighborhood. Like, the way that they're just, like, setting it up. It's just really chill. It, it, you know, it's just really chill. And I look at it, and I'm like, I want to be here. I, think I, I look at all these apartments. Because remember I told you that I want to, like, eventually move to a bigger space. Move out to... You know, we're, we're proclaiming it, we're professing it out into the universe that, to God, that, you know, I I have a new home. I have a new home. And um, I'm just looking around and I'm just like really feeling the vibe and the energy. I'm just like, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. Like, my home is, is out there. My home. I'm going to manifest my new home. It's out there. So, yeah. That's just basically it. Um, I really don't have any other plans. Like I said, I'm really just taking this um, this weekend and these next few days to just really um, um, to just reset, realign, recharge. And I feel good. I've been fasting, so this is like the juice is actually my my first meal. Like I haven't eaten anything. The only thing I had was just coffee and some water. But other than that, I haven't eaten anything. And yesterday, all I had after we last spoke was just like a soup. And that's it. And I feel really, really good. Like, I really do. I really do. 2021 is, is off to a good start. So, I'm going to go home. I'm going to chill. And just keep doing me. Keep doing some more soul work. Keep raising up my vibe and my energy and take care of me right now so that's it you guys so i will catch you all later or not i don't know but other than that just an update i'm feeling really really good i'm feeling really really good and i hope that you guys are too and that your 2021 is off to a good start so catch you guys later hey guys and welcome back to the channel don't forget to like share and subscribe so real quick since i have some downtime right now i'm just gonna catch you guys up so the last time i saw you guys was on saturday saturday afternoon girl girl these last few days i can't i can't even like explain to you today is a better day though that i will say today is a better day um so saturday night i got a call right that somebody tested positive for covid at work and you know automatically what you gotta do you gotta get tested and you gotta quarantine so um that's kind of what i was faced with that night 
but um after i kind of just like calmed down because obviously when you get those um that kind of news that's you know you automatically think like okay i gotta find a testing center i gotta get tested and then it just becomes a waiting game for you to know your results and everything like that so that's kind of where my headspace was in that moment to just quickly do everything which thankfully i tested negative for it so i'm happy about that um but anyway i just wanted to come here and tell you guys just you know i wanted to share just how everything like when i saw that whole situation in a whole and from me fasting friday and saturday i was like everything here is happening for a reason why why do i say that because all right you guys know that i was fasting friday saturday basically i was fasting all weekend and i'm kind of like doing that still i'm just fasting mentally spiritually physically and everything like that so i was really um focused heavily on i've been focused on doing some soul work and those last two days right i was listening to so many sermons about faith and just having faith and really getting myself into the mindset of knowing that i can manifest anything that i want that anything and everything is possible and so um just that every but obviously when you learn something what do you got to do you got to put it into practice so and um i felt as if in that moment everything just kind of like led me to put my faith into practice so i had to put in faith that one i was going to manifest testing negative for covid which i did i had to put into practice scripting like mind you i had sparkle marie's journal and i never like i didn't know when i was going to start writing in the journal because it's a different journaling style for me i have to write it it's a very it's different for most people but it's very very hard sometimes for i'll use myself as an example to put the faith in in writing i am going to experience or manifest xyz it's very hard to talk to talk as if you're going to have something you know what i'm saying to kind of like bring it into your reality it's it's, it's you have to work through a lot of limiting beliefs to know that to come from a place that you are worthy of things you are worthy of you know you do create your own reality your thoughts have energy so all of that just like really put me into a place where i had to put in practice what i was learning to have faith to believe that i was going to manifest everything that i wanted wanted to which basically was to test negative for covid which i did and that you know my whole experience how my testing experience was going to be and how my days were going to be and just things like that i was just putting in writing down so it's like you know that moment really just shifted me to one believe and put into practice what i've been learning so i honestly believe that all of that wasn't a coincidence all of that was for something to teach me something and um day what day three day two is when all that happened and you know i feel like it's all a push in the right direction i really do i really do believe that everything was a push for the right direction to keep believing to stay positive to uh, push forward with what i'm doing with the soul work with bettering myself with showing up as the best version of myself don't mind me i have like a sports bra and my waist trainer so if i'm looking cray cray that's all and I'm vlogging from my kitchen because I had some downtime. Right now, I'm working from home. Even that yesterday. Just like, kind of like setting myself up to um, get into work mode here at home is, is, is weird. But, you know, we gotta do what we gotta do. We gotta stay positive. Today is definitely a much better day than yesterday. Because I'm telling you, yesterday, my nerves and emotions and my mindset was just everywhere. And that just goes to show that even though when you're trying to stay positive things will come at you but it's really up to you to remember that you do deserve to have good things in your life you do deserve to feel good you do deserve to have better days and you know you are a powerful manifester with god everything is possible if you just believe that if you just believe in that believe me when i tell you everything will shift for the better and you will learn so many great things about yourself and about life about lessons and i'm getting really deep and it's only 1 
20 something so in the afternoon but it's all good you know what i'm saying it's, i just i wanted to come on upload this video so you guys have something to look at because you know i'm not gonna let a week go by without posting i'm not gonna stop i'm not gonna stop being consistent i'm just gonna do what i can with what i have and you know baby steps and then you know the channel's gonna get bigger you know i'm gonna be creating more and more ideas are gonna be coming to me but i had to turn on the camera so yeah i just wanted to give you guys a quick update where i'm at what i'm doing and i'll catch you guys in the next video positive vibes to each and every one of you um and i'm sending you all also positive vibes with any goals that you have for the new year anything that you're working on anything that you want to manifest positive vibes all right so i will catch you guys later don't forget to hit that like share and subscribe button and that's it i'll talk to you guys soon bye